Hi, I am Santosh. I will explain you experiment number 10, determination of Planck's constant by using the method of photoelectric effect from course number PH110 physics laboratory course. In this video, first we will learn the equipment and then we will determine the Planck's constant by doing the experiment. So let's start. To do this experiment, we will use this Planck's constant setup. This setup contains a vacuum photo tube as a photosensitive device inside this chamber. This chamber has a tube type opening with an opaque plastic cap for its protection. A halogen tungsten lamp as a light source which is able to move on an optical bench. For determination of Planck's constant, this optical bench has no role. A current detecting unit in microampere range, which gives values in nanoampere when the multiplier is at 0.001. The same display will give value of voltage when this toggle switch is towards voltage side. A light intensity adjuster knob which will be kept at most during the experiment. A voltage adjuster knob with a toggle switch for choice of direction of voltage which will be kept negative during the experiment and a power switch to operate this equipment. We will do the experiment with some color filters. Red of wavelength 635 nanometer. Orange of wavelength 570 nanometer. Yellow of wavelength 540 nanometer. Green of wavelength 500 nanometer and blue of wavelength 460 nanometer. We will take descending order of wavelengths for our convenience. The observation table to get the stopping potentials for the used wavelengths will seem like this. We have to take utmost care of light source and the vacuum phototube kept inside the chamber. If we switch on and off the light source often, then it may get fused. And also, if we give intense light to the photo tube, it may malfunction. To protect both, without switching off the light source, we will take out the plastic cap with our one hand and place one color filter by another hand, without exposing the tube to intense light. We will repeat this process at choice of different filters and at last we will place the black plastic cap again. Now we are starting the experiment. The plastic cap is at its place. The power switch is on. The light intensity knob is at its most now. For current detection, this toggle switch is towards current direction and the multiplier is at 0.001. The voltage direction toggle switch is in negative direction. Now we are replacing the black plastic cap with red color filter having wavelength 635 nanometer. Now we are accelerating the voltage in negative direction and as we can see the value of current is decreasing. We will stop this voltage adjuster when current reaches to zero and here is the situation. At this time we will check the voltage by switching this toggle switch towards voltage direction. This gives the stopping potential for the used wavelength and the value is minus 0.35 volt. We will repeat it thrice. This is the first reading. And for second set, we switch this toggle switch 
towards current direction and slightly adjust this voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. At this time we are getting the stopping potential minus 0 0.35 volt. For third set we are switching this toggle switch towards current direction and again rotating the voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerating the voltage adjuster in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. At this time we are getting the stopping potential minus 0 0.35 volt. Now we are replacing the red color filter with orange having wavelength 570 nanometer. For the current detection this toggle switch is in current direction and multiplier is at 0 0.001. The voltage accelerator direction is negative. We are accelerating the voltage in negative direction and as we can see the current value is decreasing. We will stop this rotation when current reaches at 0 and here is the position. At this time we are getting a stopping potential minus 0 0.58 volt. This is the first set and for second set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust this voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate the voltage adjuster in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. In second set we are getting the stopping potential minus 0 0.58 volt. For third set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and again rotate the voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate it in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. We are getting minus 0 0.58 volt in third set. Now we are replacing the orange color filter with yellow having wavelength 540 nanometer. For the current detection this toggle switch is towards current direction and the voltage direction is negative and we are accelerating the voltage in negative direction and as we can see the current values are decreasing and we will stop this voltage adjuster when the current reaches to 0 and here is the position. We will check the voltage by this toggle switch and it is showing minus 0 0.72 volt. This is the stopping potential for the used wavelength in first set. For second set, we are switching this current switch towards current direction and voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate the voltage adjuster in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. We are getting minus 0 0.72 volt as a stopping potential in second set. For third set, set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust this voltage adjuster in some positive values of current and again accelerate the voltage adjuster in negative direction to get the current value 0 and here is the position. In third set we are getting minus 0 0.72 volt as a stopping potential for the used wavelength. Now we are replacing the yellow color filter with green having wavelength 500 nanometer. For the detection of current this toggle switch is in current direction and the multiplier is at 0.001 the voltage direction is negative here 
and now we are accelerating the voltage in negative direction and as we can see the value of current is decreasing we will stop this voltage adjuster when the current reaches at zero and here is the position in first set we are getting the stopping potential minus 0 0.92 volt for second set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust this voltage adjuster in some positive values of current and again accelerate it in negative direction to get the value of current 0 and here is the position. In second set we are getting the stopping potential at minus 0 0.92 volt. For third set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust this voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate this in negative direction to get the value of current 0 and here is the position. In third set the obtained stopping potential is minus 0 0.92 volt. Now we are replacing the green color filter with blue having wavelength 460 nanometer. For current detection this toggle switch is in current direction. The multiplier is at 0 0.001 and the voltage direction is negative. Now we accelerate the voltage in negative direction and as we can see the current value is decreasing. We will stop this when current reaches to 0 and here is the position. In first set we are getting a stopping potential minus 1.08 volt. For second set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust the voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate this in negative direction to get the value of current 0 and here is the position. We are getting the stopping potential minus 1.08 volt in second set. For third set we switch this toggle switch towards current direction and adjust this voltage adjuster to get some positive values of current and again accelerate this in negative direction to get the current value 0 and we are getting it now. The obtained stopping potential in third set is minus 1.08 volt. As we have taken the readings thrice for each wavelength, we will take mean of stopping potentials for each wavelength separately. As the observation is complete, we are replacing the blue color filter with opaque black plastic cap and switch off this light source by minimizing its intensity and this switch and then we just adjust the voltage adjuster anti-clockwise at its uh, initial condition. The toggle switch in current direction and finally we can switch off the power button. We will plot a graph a stopping potential versus frequency. The obtained a straight line's slope will give h by e and thus we can determine the Planck's constant. The intercept of extrapolated point at frequency nu equal to 0 will give work function phi. Thank you.